Hello everyone and welcome to week six. In the following week, we will highlight the following. This video aims to give a brief synopsis of the elements and the objectives that we will cover throughout the week. For this week, we will be using the national book also. So make sure in the first lesson on uh, Monday, perhaps, if your first lesson is on Monday or if your first lesson is on Sunday, make sure that you have the national book with you. Uh, the national book is Living Together. There is a book and a workbook. And we will be focusing on lesson seven. Lesson seven that highlights how to live or for a better world. Uh, how can we live in a better world, making sure that it is more sustainable and effective for the well-being of the ecosystem and the environment in addition to social factors. In this lesson, we will cover the following objectives. We will discuss occurring issues such as water, land, air, noise pollution, and we will highlight the impact it has on global warming. Moreover, you will skim and scan the text and answer comprehension questions. The comprehension questions are in your workbook. So after briefly discussing what is water, land, air, noise pollution, you'll be divided into groups. And in groups, you will answer the comprehension questions that are based on a lesson. So I recommend here that, for example, those that are responsible for lesson one, someone for lesson two, and someone for lesson three from the book, in order to finish in a timely manner, this will assess also your self-management skills. Moreover, in the second lesson, we will highlight the following. We are going to read and annotate the second case study in your I and S book. So after we're done with the uh, national book, please bring in your individuals and society book uh, by year concept number one. We will highlight primary deforestation and the impact of deforestation. As we discussed prior, if you remember smart solutions, smart objectives, which means specific, measurable, achievable, realistic, and time-specific, you will analyze possible solutions that reduce def deforestation and the impact it has on the wildlife. Moreover, the ATLs include social collaboration because you will discuss them and come up with creative methods and techniques to reduce it with your peers, and you will communicate them in front of the classroom. And finally, the third lesson is going to be an explicit lesson, which is directly related to forestation. You will be divided into groups. Each group will be receive a scenario and you'd need to draw up reasonable conclusions and re generalizations. So I would give, for example, group A about deforestation and they'd need to draw up reasonable conclusions and generalizations about the topic. I wish you a lovely week and a prosperous week.